tip. I'm going to take this peachy color right here on a blending brush and just apply it all over the eyelids. Look at that, how pigmented that is. Super pigmented, super easy to blend out. You want to have that pop of color so by your you don't look too bland, too boring. So you depends on what you want to amp up. Like for me, for this look that we're gonna be doing today, we're gonna to push out a little bit more on the eyes. So the rest of the face is gonna be slightly more mellower in terms of color. So just blend that out. Okay, so just make sure that you've got that into the crease. Just blend it out. So, because her eyes is more separate, <laughs> right? So, it's a monolid. So, you gotta take the color upwards. Because when she opens her eyes, you don't really see the eyelid. So, that's why you gotta take the color up, up, further up into the crease. Okay? Or, you know. So, you take that, the bronzer, and you just. There you go, you put it in the outer corner just to deepen that part right there. You just want to create that dimension. There. So, at the outer corner. And just blend it outwards. Right here, this champagne, champagne gold color on our flat, small flat shader brush, and I'm gonna apply it, apply it on the eyelids. There you go. You want to pack that color on because we want that glow on the eyelids. Same thing on the other side. On this side. On this side. Just underneath your cheeks. that her face is already contoured. You gotta brush it out and blend it well. Over on this side. And of course, we wanna bronze out our forehead as well. Bronze it up just to make sure that the whole face is seamless and selfie ready. And you want to get rid of the double chin. Even though Joyce doesn't have any double chin, I'm just going to bronze it up as if she has one. Just to keep that makeup seamless. This one first. I like to layer my blushes so that you create more dimension. So I'm going to create, I'm going to use this strawberry crush and just apply it on the cheekbones. Cup on her cheeks just to give you that fresh looking skin. Take Peach Sunset over here and just mix it up right there. Don't be afraid to put a lot of blush because you know that blush is going to disappear and also if on cameras you kind of have to put a little bit extra if you want to take photos because that's where you can see it. If not, nanti kan the camera tu akan macam you know it lessens with our oil because we get oily so it's good to just put a lot but don't go overboard of course just make sure it's enough for you to see and Nose. Okay, so I'm gonna contour our nose. I'm gonna be using this brush. I'm gonna contour the nose. 
This is coconut cabana, same thing, same color that we used just now for bronzing and contouring. You can actually use a an eyeshadow brush to contour your nose. <coughs> there you go. Uh, there's actually a pearlescent. There's pearls inside this uh, loose powder, so it's very interesting. The langkah one apa macam you guys sparkly, sparkly. Eh tak adalah. Tapi <laughs> it's just look up. It just further enhance the whole look and makes it more smoother, makes the skin more smoother, and apa macam more glowing. Everybody wants to be glowy nowadays, and just set wherever that you have oily skin. Now only we're going to take our fan brush and use our piña colada to highlight to add on that glow. There you go. Get your highlight. It's as if you're glowing from within. The other side. There you go. Look at that pretty shine. <coughs> We want to blend that in into our blush. Let's see, a little bit on the nose, at the tip of the nose. Up here, above the brow, over on this side. I'm just gonna apply that. Apply it thinly because in our lip primers we have all these good ingredients that would moisture your skin, uh, moisture your lip. And just do that. Yep. Take this and just apply it on her lips. Just your lips. The best way to apply lipstick is actually to just Smile and apply your lipstick. And then you'll get into the crevices of your lips, all the lines. You'll get the lipstick in, so then it looks much more smoother. Set the whole face. Okay, you can actually stop here if you want to, but because this is the day look lah, okay? But I'm gonna show you guys how to just amp it up with maybe one or two steps. So for so in this palette we have ten shades and we have five different type of diamond formula. So with the diamond formula, it's more sparklier. It's just like bam. You can see the glow. So I'm going to take this pinch of salt. This is also one of my faves. And just pop that right in the middle. Just right in the middle to give that extra sparkle. I'm going to keep it tight. So there you go. Right in the middle. So it's not too much, but at the same time, you can see that there's something a little extra for your date night. I like that inner corner. Because we love an inner corner highlight. So this helps to brighten up your eyes even more. 